Um, here are the patch notes. Whoa, Eric the Aimpot coming in with a resub. Everybody showing some love in the chat for 20 some thousand months. Yachts. That's pretty much what he just said. Yachts. Thank you so much for the 28 months in a row. Everybody showing some love in the chat. Thank you so much, Eric the Aimpot. Um, so yeah, I've been out of the loop a little bit with the Elite Dangerous, so these patch notes will get me and you up to date if you've been out of the loop. Um, from what I understand, from what I've been gathering on this update, a lot of it is a bunch of Guardian unlocks and Guardian sites and Guardian stuff, including Guardian fighters. Uh, there is a single new ship, which is kind of a hybrid I wouldn't know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't call it a hybrid. It's just a variant of the uh, of the chieftain and the uh, uh, the challenger, right? This is a uh, called the crusader, and it has a fighter bay. So imagine those ships with the fighter bay. Uh, so the new weapons that were added, a bunch of large weapons were added. It looks like a bunch of uh, missiles and torpedoes type of of, of weapons. Um, uh, dumb fire missiles, seeking missiles, torpedo launchers, and multi cannons. Turret. Okay, so there isn't. No. I don't know why one would use that, but that's cool. Um, small shot cannon, turret, small shot cannon, gimbaled, and a small shot cannon fix from the tech broker. Uh, the human tech broker, and also from the guardian tech broker, we got some small guardian weapons, plasma launcher, turret and fix, shark cannon, turret and fix, and gauss cannon fixed. And we talked about the crusader. I'm going to be buying one of these and checking it out. It's probably going to be the first thing I do. Um, and just see how it flies. I imagine if it has a fighter bay, it's probably not going to be a, a, as maneuverable as the uh, chieftain, but it is a medium ship with a fighter bay. So that's always a good thing. More medium ships with fighter bays, please. Uh, we want that. Uh, we got the, uh, we got the crate, of course, which is, I think is the darling of a lot of people now. Medium class ship with, uh, with the, with the fighter bay. You find the term dumb fire offensive. I prefer the term non guided. Nah, dumb fire is cool. They're pretty dumb. I'm sorry you take offense to that, but they're pretty dumb missiles. All right, some Guardian sites and Guardian puzzles and Guardian ships and Guardian stuff. I think that's what the, the, the main focus of this update is about. There's going to be a lot of new stuff um, and more uh, farming for these these new weapons. Um. I haven't got a sense of what you have to do yet. I think you have to do a puzzle. I think you have to find a key at some at some beacon and then do a puzzle or something like that. I think that's what you have to do. Um, I don't know how much mats and stuff you have to grind yet. That's something we can look into. The next thing is they added uh, they added a variety of engineers. Colonia, uh, Colonia, now has engineers. So those of you out there in Colonia and in a land. Um, they now have engineers out there, so that's cool. Welcome to the stream, everybody. How you doing, Astro? Thanks for coming by. Cerebus is here. Hey, guys. Did they mess up the boom time delivery mission? I don't know. I don't know what happened. I don't know anything. I'm just getting involved. Um, let's see. Two new wing mission type, wing mission types, planetary settlement hack and planetary settlement disable. Okay, so these seems like SRV missions that they've uh, given us wing mission types. To be curious of what these are all about. Uh, the design of hollow screen advertisements are now in the game and a bunch of fixes and improvements and blah, 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 blah. So like I said, I think this is more of a guardian based update and they did promise us two smaller updates before the bigger update at the, at the end of the year. So this is the second of the smaller updates. We got a ship. Uh, we got some new fighters. We got some Guardian Tech stuff. And, uh, yeah. 
that's the theme of the patch. So let's go ahead and launch. Boom, 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 boom. Game is launching now. If I'm not mistaken, I'm in my crate. Yeah, I'm in a crate. So I'll head to Founders and I'll pick up this new Crusader and see what it's all about. Um, maybe we can take it out to the Guardian sites. I don't know what the jump range is on it though. So I might just use my crate because my crate has a decent jump range. Whoa, I don't want to click that. What you doing, voice attack? I don't want to click you. Okay, so. We'll, we'll go in our OMG private group. Hopefully. Thank you. OMG. All right. I think there's like, you know, the foam in your headset. I think it's like chipping off and like getting into my ears. It's making my ears itch. Yeah, it is. It's kind of annoying. <laughs> I mean, I, I need some new pads, man. They're 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 in rough shape. Okay, uh, let's plot the founders. How far am I from founders anyway? Not that far. All right, I haven't flown this thing in a while, but what I do remember, I did like the crate quite a bit. It's been like a kind of like a Python replacement. Engines engaged. Retract landing gear. Retract landing. Oh, I turned off listening. There we go. Retract landing gear. I hope we are going to make some credits. Your balance is looking pretty shabby, Commander. Jump. Assuming direct control. There are Long. too many Just games to play. Me. We go fast now. <laughs> Just this week, I got. I mean, we got three releases here. We got this update, uh, Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate on the Switch, and then we got the Path of Exile Delve League on Friday. Three, so two, that's gonna be. One, that's a lot of new stuff, man. All of which are designed to take all of your time. Like, those are three games that you can sink a thousand hours into without blinking. It's one of those things, man. All right, how much? Uh, three jumps? Okay. So I think I have a fuel tank on here because I don't have to refuel. And judging by the amount of fuel I use on that one jump. Yeah, I don't think I... 26, 27 light years jump range. Yeah, I don't think I... Fuel tank would be at the bottom, wouldn't it? No, it's not even powered. I don't know why I'm looking here. Herp. You don't power fuel tank, chat. Jump. Pushing the go fast button, commander. Yeah, it's like... Um, I think that's what... Especially free-to-play games... They're 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 designed so that you have to put a lot of time into them, Four, because that's how three, they deal with competition. Two, one, You're so busy playing their game that you don't even have time to check out the competition. That's that's kind of the gaming world we live in. Vomitus, just subscribe with Twitch Prime. Everybody's showing some love in the chat. Thank you so much for that support, dude. I really appreciate it. First new sub of the day. We got a resub earlier. The number at the bottom right, you see it ticked up to two. That's the total number of sub points gained today. Wow. Once we get five new subs, we give away a sub. So if you guys ever heard about Twitch Prime, let me educate you a little bit. Hey, 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 you, you, yeah, you. Come here. Do you own Amazon Prime? You do? Wow. Did you know you could get a free subscription on Twitch? How? Well, I'm glad you asked. Link your Amazon account Four, to your Twitch account. Three, That's it. You're done. Two, 
Come back to twitch.tv slash one and get your free sub. Thanks. And you're welcome. Look at that knowledgeable knowledge right there. I'm telling you, boy. Wow. Yep. That's knowledgeable. Thank you so much again, Vominus, for that Twitch Prime subscription. It helps a tremendous, tremendous amount here at twitch.tv slash one. Thank you, man. You are appreciated. Wow. Yep. <laughs> now playing not set. What are you talking about, girl? Uh, I'm at that Nerg farm in Monster Hunter World. I need that armor set for my bow build. Ooh. Cool. Indeed. Yes. Indeed. Cool. Indeed. Did you know? I didn't know. Yep. Four, three, two. All right, we're going to take a look-see at this Crusader. See if it's going to be crusading. If it doesn't crusade at 11 out of 10 decibels, if, if I can't turn this up to 11, if if I'm not crusading in my sleep after flying this ship, I'm going to want my money back. All zero dollars and zero cents, chat. Okay. I need to come up with a new name for my crate. I think the, the pun loot crate kind of died an hour before I picked the name. So we're going to have to come up with a legitimate name for our crate instead of loot crate. That's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of awful. It's kind of, kind of bad. I don't think. Uh, that's... Yeah, I better be crusading pretty hard, man. And I just loop of shame. This is our inaugural loop of shame for the stream chat. We are now officially back on Elite Dangerous. We just loop of shame our first loop of shame. And it's shameful. It's a shameful display of shame. You know? I'm okay with that. These are things that I am okay with. This this is the these are the these are the activities in life that that make me go, hmm, yes. I am human and I can make mistakes. And I'm good with that because I'm good enough, I'm smart enough, and gosh darn it, people like me. Even though I make a mistake, you know? Yes, loop of shame, chat. Paint it purple and name it the Great Grape Crate. Nah. I'm just going to keep the crate pun out of it. I might call it something like Charlie or Flower. Look at that flower fly. I don't know. I'll come up with something stupid. <laughs> and scene. Buona, how many hours do you have in Elite? You want me to look? Request docking. Oh gosh, shutting down and uploading myself to Google. I can look. Wait till I dock though. Floor landing gear. Show them how a good landing is done, Commander. Oh, I needed that to slow down. That's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. Oh, I forgot to boop the snoot. Okay, there we go. We booped the snoot. We're done. All is well in Buona Land. Alright, so how many hours do I have? Let's see. Uh, 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 wait. What are you doing? Stop. No. Exploration. Uh, I have nine weeks, four days, nine hours, 31 minutes. Whatever that is. That's a great view. <laughs> Nine weeks, four days, nine hours, 31 minutes. That's my play time. Okay. Well, I'm new to the game. I'm loving it. How good are you? How good are the devs in your opinion? I don't know. I'm glad you're loving the game, though. 
That's all that matters, right? At the end of the day. If you're enjoying the game, who cares how the devs are? Okay. I want myself a crusader and I want a crusade. No, oh, there it is. Okay, I see the fin difference between that and the challenger. Oh, they don't have the... Oh, I thought they'd all be together. I guess they go by size. Okay, there's a the chieftain. I'm just looking at the silhouettes. It looks like the tail fin is like the major difference on how you can tell between these. Crusader has the the spoiler. That has a spoiler too, but it has the things on it. Interesting. So there's slight variants of each other, which I expect. Uh, let's store the current ship. Crusadering set to stun. <laughs> David, how are you doing today? Welcome, dude. All right, let's get an external view of this thing once I get settled. External view. What you're looking at? Ooh. Oh, that's that's kind of pretty. Oh, I like. Okay. Yeah, it's just got the grasshopper legs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. For sure, for sure. There's the booty. There's the booty. You can see the spoiler alert chat. Spoiler alert. Um. It's split down the middle. I didn't know that. I thought it was one big fin. Um, everything else looks similar. I think. There's probably some minor variations that I'm missing. Back inside. All right. Let's go to outfitting. See what we got here. Hard points. Got a large, two mediums, three smalls. Yeah, they they do pack it in. So I could throw like a large multi cannon on here now. Right? A, a turreted one at that. Because that's new. There it is. A large turreted multi cannon. Interesting. You could really get your multi crew on with that one, boy. Ducka, 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 ducka. It's not huge, but it's large. Um, I don't know. What, what am I going to put? Where is this at, by the way? Where is this? Where is this slot? Oh, it's on top. Right? Yeah, that. That's. Yeah, in the middle. Top, top middle. Thanks for redeeming that ye. Someone must have did that either way. Oh, Kung Fu did it. There we go. Thanks for the bits, man. Okay, and these are... Man, I really wish they had a better view of, of where these guns are. I'm kinda, I am kind of have to really use my brain to figure out where they are. Um, I guess I could just throw... Some large torpedoes. Interesting. Didn't expect it to look like that. Cannons. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Very interesting. I think I'm just go all multi cannons. Because I'm boring, chat. Ah, oh, Borna. You have purchased a three C gimbaled multi cannon for five hundred and seven thousand five hundred and seventy nine credits. That's going to get on my nerves, I can tell. And I forgot to command the trailer to shut up, too. All right. Nope, wrong one. Nope, wrong one. Yes, right one. You have purchased a 2F gimbaled multi cannon for 50,018 credits and sold a 1F fixed pulse laser for 1930 credits. 
that's enough. Let's see if that's the command. I think that's the command. Otherwise, I'm going to have to dig it out and voice to text. See what I said. You have purchased the 2F Be gimbaled multic cannon for 50,018 credits and sold a 1F fixed pulse laser oh, for 1930 okay. credits. Okay, um, we got to look this up. I thought this was it. Yeah. Okay. Pong. Shut up! Be quiet. Hey, that's it. I'm pretty sure that's it. Yeah, disable speech responder. That's the one. Oh man, the voice attack bugs in the brain. I have to work them out. I don't remember all my commands. All right, these smalls. I'm just gonna do multi. It's just gonna be multi cannons everywhere. Multi cannon. Dugga 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 dugga. Well, it's 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 a it's a voice attack plugin for ED. Um. Which I have set up to do that, so it's not its fault. That's how I have it configured. By default, that's on, and I have to explicitly turn it off. So I just forgot the command to turn it off. Honestly, I don't think I even want it anymore. I just have it there for show. Uh, da -da -da -da. All right. Multi cannons are everywhere, chat. So utilities, we got four utilities. So I guess a couple shield boosters and uh, that you build this a couple of shield boosters and maybe a chaff, maybe a single chaff, and a uh, probably some kind of a scanner here. KWS, or to like. KWS, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Do I need a heat? No, I'm multi cannons. I don't need a heat sink. You say that now. You you, you say that now, Buana. You, you say it now. I don't need a heat sink. Five hours later. Man, I wish I would have put a heat sink on here. Core internals. Um, I guess I can go with military grade to start. Because I'm not sure if this is going to be a hull or a shield tank. Class 6. Yeah. I got to decide where I want to hull a shield tank this. Probably going to going to hull tank it because what I remember the you no, know, I really didn't fly the Challenger. I'm not even going to say that. I didn't fly the Challenger hardly at all. I flew the Chieftain, and I used that as kind of a hull tank. I put a lot of armor on that. Life support. Class D. That'll do, Piggy. That'll do. 6A distributor. Of course. And a partridge in a pair of sensors. 4D sensors. Um... All right, so we're at 15 light years. Oof. That is that is the oof, chat. That's with class A frame shift. And military grade armor. I can go lightweight on armor. And then just engineer it to heavy. Let's do that. Let's go lightweight and then just, you know, engineer it to heavy. That'll give me 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sopel's here. What up? How you doing? Um, probably with a fat shield, a delicious, juicy, fat, six A shield. Acknowledged. Shields at max. Uh, uh, 
What's in my cargo? What? The deuce. Hot. What? It, it hard froze for a good half second there. Why do I have limpets? I guess I took the limpets from the other ship when I... <laughs> Okay, uh... Shield generators. Hey, what's up, Craig Gallon? How you doing, man? Yeah, we're trying out the 3.2 update. This is one of the new ships. Well, this is the new ship in the 3.2 update. This is the Crusader. So far, I haven't crusaded much yet. Interesting. So we got three fours in military. I was like, where are the fours? They're all military. Um, yeah, I'll throw a cargo in here. That's probably all the cargo I need, right? Uh, we'll throw the scanner. Should doodles on here. So we got a basic. Let's upgrade that to an advance. Wait, let's throw that in a one. No, we don't have a one. Uh, advance scanner. Still armoring up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's true. And this is true. And here we will throw a um, detailed surface scanner for giggles. Now, in the class fours, I'm probably just going to put a whole reinforcement. But I do need an SRV. And I would like collector limp collector limpets. SRV. Uh, planetary vehicle. <sighs> Hang up. I don't. I mean, I don't think I have a choice. I think I have to put in a class five. If I want a fighter hanger, because that's the whole reason. I guess I have to. You kind of have to chat. It's a whole. This is the, the only difference between this ship and the other ones. You have to put a fighter hangar, and eventually, hopefully, <laughs> we can put a. Uh, a what you call it in here? A guardian fighter. I don't know how long it's gonna take to farm that. If we get that tonight, I'll be surprised. Uh, what do I want? I want the. I usually go for the. Um, The fixed plasma, I think, is good. The pew. There we go. Uh, so I, I'm gonna need cargo. So I think the rest of this class three cargo is gonna suck. I think, but you know, it's eight tons. I guess that's acceptable. Because there's no class three fighter hangar, so it's like I can only use these two. Can't use the military. And I'm thinking one shield cell bank. I think I'm okay on power. Maybe. If I do some juggling and hull reinforcement. And probably a single module reinforcement. This build is off the top of my head. Probably not going to be the best. Yeah, I'm right at the limit. I'm going to have to, you know, I'm going to have to juggle some stuff. Why does this freeze? Man, that's weird. That's why it freezes. Okay, so if I go to modules here, we're going to go to... Um, let's see. Cargo hatch, we'll put it... Oh, it's only at two. Frame shift drive, we'll put it three. Collected leper controller, we'll put it four. And, um, yeah, I think the rest is okay. KWS, I'll put lower too. Not at four, but at three. Yeah, we're at a 105. That's fine. 